Hi. Well, here's a really interesting little gun. Now this is a Stevens uh, tip-up uh, uh, single shot pistol. Now there are several different uh, models of this, a lot of different models of these little guns. And I'm pretty sure I know uh, what this one is. I think it's a Diamond Model uh, 43. But as I said, there were so many little variations of this gun that I'm not positive about that. Most of them that you see are the Model uh, 41s, which have uh, just uh, crude fixed sights and usually about a three and a half inch barrel. Now this one has adjustable sights and a six inch barrel. And the operation of these little guns is just uh, like a break open shotgun. Just a tip up design single shot chambered in 22 long rifle. Now they made bigger versions of these and smaller versions and if they do have a serial number this seems to be where they're at right there. Let's see if we can get the rest of the markings to show up here. And most often these were uh, made with a nickel frame and a blue barrel but sometimes you do see them that are all blue it has a frame mounted firing pin there the little safety catch notch keeps the hammer up off of the firing pin so that it's not resting on the cartridge the adjustable sights are a little crude, but they do work. But uh, very hard to see. This is a very small gun. Spur trigger. Does have grips that are big enough to at least get a hold of anyway. Very lightweight. I doubt if this weighs more than about uh, more than about seven ounces and the smaller ones uh, say like the model 41 Stevens are even lighter weight than this but just in general these are uh, just an interesting little gun and it has a pretty good bore in it and these were made from, uh, I would guess that this was probably made around 1920. Now some of these little guns were made clear up into the 30s and it's really hard to tell exactly when uh, one of these guns were made because there were no, as far as I know, there were no uh, records kept, just uh, kind of okay we know uh, when they started making them and when they quit started uh, quit making them and from the serial number uh, you can kind of guess okay it's somewhere in the middle so it's probably about 1920 or so and that's about as close as I've been able to find out about it but I thought it was just an interesting little gun a gun this old it was probably designed for uh, standard velocity 22 long rifle and I will get this little critter out and shoot it sometime or other. When I find out how it works here, I may start it off with uh, 22 CB caps, or 22 long uh, CB caps or something. But that's for a future video. But anyway, I want to do an end of video shout out. And this one's for the Real Cobra Burnout. And I'll put a link to his channel in the description of this video. If you get a little free time. Go check it out. Thanks for watching.